Hello, you are welcome back to my channel, viewers all over the world. You are welcome back to this wonderful channel where we discuss a very wonderful spiritual tips how to solve the problem of humanity. We are not diabolic and we are not fetish. My name is Ekene Ekenpo. We share spiritual tips. The spiritual tips we share are those spiritual tips. We do some traditional science. What I mean by traditional science, we combine natural things together from the way the old indies people do in order to come up with a solution that can help you to solve some of these problems that are disturbing humanity. So this channel is a channel of webbing where we share the spiritual tips and we are not fetish and we are not diabolic. I repeat, we do things in a proper way. We are Christians, we go to church. So without wasting most of your time, I have a very important video to discuss with you today. This topic is how to wash your hand of any evil you committed that have been blocking you from getting the right thing that you're supposed to get. Sometimes hands have been stained in a very different way. These hands are very, very important because this sign you see here, this line is called Akaraka. If you are an Igbo, Akaraka in, it means destiny. Your destiny is in your hand. This hand, the way your hand is, it means something. If you check this line, your own might be different, another person's own must be different. So that is how God blessing are according to everybody. So that's why the hand line, this line, is different from every other person. Check my own and check your own. You see that it's different. So, there is a spiritual thing that attached to that. But by the time you stain it with blood, you stain it with evil, you use it and commit a lot of atrocity, you begin to receive different kind of disappointment, different kind of repercussion. You may not know, maybe you have committed some evil things long ago, but it's in your hand, it has stained your hand. So this today's video is how to do that spiritual cleansing, how to wash your hand in a spiritual way so that anything you lay your hand will begin to prosper. Today is Sunday. I want to share this spiritual tips because a lot of people have been suffering in different kind of situation. Maybe the situation you don't know because of their, their hand they have soiled in one evil or the other. Some of you that have touched some places and you don't know the, what you touch is evil. What you touch need, needed to be cleansed. The, the place you touch your hand, you needed to clean it so that things will begin to work for you. Now, if you want to cleanse your hand from evils that you don't know that you use your hand touch, or if you want to cleanse your hand properly, in case if you have stained your hand before unknowingly then watch this video so how to start it you need to get a local color badge look at it go to a spiritual shop or a local shop you will get something like this a bowl like this local one then you get salt now this salt one to turn you get salt then you pour water inside oh. so after pouring water inside a clean water and the water must be a rain water water that fall from the sky that doesn't touch the zinc that doesn't touch any other tree Fetch it direct from the heaven, direct from the sky. Thank God this time is raining season. Put table on the middle of your compound where there is no tree, no, where there is no obstruction and get this type of water you are going to use to wash out every atrocity, every evil, every stained hand that are affecting your success. Why will you salt? Salt represents success. Salt brings good things in life. 
for the reason of washing their hands against every evil thing they have done, then they will need salt. That is why salt is good. Salt is used for opening door. Salt is used to clean everything evil in life. Salt is also a success thing. Salt brings tests. So if you are bitter before, if you are not, if you are testless, testless, then when you add a salt into a dish, the dish will begin to test, you begin to feel it, begin to enjoy it. So that's why we use salt in making inviting good things. So we are going to use salt after washing your hand, then we are going to use salt to make it to their hand will be clean, will become a successful hand. Now now, how to use this thing wash your hand? You are going to pray. Pray and commit everything you know that you have done with your hand. If you things you have done with your hand, mention it, mention it one by one. The ones you can remember, mention it and ask for forgiveness. Why ask for forgiveness? You pour the salt and ask for forgiveness. After praying for the salt and the water, then you begin to mention those evil things you can remember you committed. Then you use it and raise over your head. You raise over your head as you are removing all the atrocities you are committed. You raise over your head seven times. And knee down. Knee down and hold the water and also pray again for success that you need success that every evil things you have committed you have as you are going to wash your hand in this water you are going to be free person good things shall be coming in your way by kneeling down and you pray after praying you reject every evil by raising it turning it against your head seven times by saying you reject every evil that have been tormenting you every evil that you use your hand commit that have been tormenting you that you want to be free from it after saying it seven times you said he say he say mean amen or so shall it be so after that you now wash your hand or hold this water for me So, you use the water. I hope you are watching me. Make sure you mix the, the salt properly. You mix it. You now wash your hand. Wash your hand. As you are washing your hand, you are praying that you are washing away every evil. Every evil that this hand committed. Every blood that this hand shed. Everything, everywhere you touch Every evil thing you use your hand to touch, every evil money, every evil hand you shake, every evil woman you touch your hand, every disappointment person that you touch your hand, every strange woman that you touch your hand, by playing by in any means, you said you wash it away. You clean it very well. After cleaning it, don't re use something like towel to clean the hand. You go to sun and allow it to use sun dry to dry the hand. Stay as much as possible until the hand dry. Do not use something to clean it. Then, from that time goes on, you are going to begin to see a tremendous success in your life. Anything you lay your hand upon, you begin to move, you begin to be successful. This ritual is very, very wonderful. Do not underrate it and put your faith on it. You will see how things begin to work for you. Because when you look into the society, you see a lot of things be doing things. Anything you lay a hand, it will not move. Anything you lay a hand, it will not succeed. Can't you ask your first question? Say, what is going on? Why other people are their own is succeeding? Because sometimes you don't know what you have used your hand to commit. Maybe you are around, when you are young, when you are small, you have used your hand to touch something that is evil, that, that you have shed the blood. You have used your hand 
take an evil money. Some of those, or use your hand and touch evil women because there's an evil woman. You touch some certain part of their part and it's going to be affecting you. So some of these things, you don't know what is affecting your sources. So that's why it's good to do this washing hand cleansing. To wash away every dirty that is affecting your sources, that are affecting whatever you lay your hand on. So then, how do you use this water? Make sure you throw away this water on the main road. Throw it on the main road. Do not allow parts of it to be with you. Throw it on the main road and also dry this, this container, this calabash. Dry it with sun dry. Do not, if you want to use it again, dry it with sun dry. Let it sun dry it completely. As you dry your hand with sun dry, then you can use it, use it again. Or better still, you trash it away. Because this, the pots and everything have been used to wash away every and every evil thing that stains your hand that is affecting your sources. So this video is very very important. It works in everywhere you are, no matter your race, no matter the world, any part of the world you are. This wonderful ritual works. So you can do it in America, in UK, in anywhere you are. You can practice it. So we remain the spiritual tip sharer. If you are not yet subscribed to this channel, please kindly do so by touching the red button written subscribe and also touch the bell notification so that you'll be notified whenever we uploaded a new video because we are going to share a lot of spiritual tips that are going to help you in one way or the other thank you for watching this video please whenever you are practicing our, our video make sure you put your faith trust it and it will work for you double-minded we make your rituals not to be effective. Thank you and God bless you. He say.